Okay, go. do All the right intros. Go. All right. Hello and welcome. This is ENSL Division 3 Finals Natural Selection 2 Grahanduri versus Minty. I am Salanthia. I am casting with Arclight. How you doing? Just fine. So we have uh, Grahanduri as the Marine starting in control and poor Minty starting in Pipeline, the worst starting location in NS2 Vale. Yeah, and we again have Satania going for Topographical. If we remember the semi-finals game, she got raped there with the early rush. <laughs> and that's something we're not nice to see. Nandy gonna get jumped. First oh, small engagement and system waypointing. Oh, look at that. Assisting all the way up to cargo to get an RT up. Of I, I don't know if that's worth it, especially going over C12. Well, it's like the control of nanogrid is really important in this map. And you can't really do it from pipeline. The assisting chain is just much too far to get there. But uh, we got Croc in cargo, followed by Lieutenant Cramner and coming in. Oh, Eximo's going to save his ass as well. Oh. And there goes oh, the RT. Down. Oh, there's one up here. Uh, oh, there was a uh, alien jumping on topographical. This is good though, Grounder. They're keeping them from getting go as their second point, which they will need coming out of pipeline. They most definitely need that observatory done and phase gate tech started if they want to keep this up. And aliens are gathering up in cargo. Big fight, big fight. And the Marines go down. There's still Satanic takes out the. I think it was Dave's up in C12. He's trying to take out the source tower there. Oh, but Croc OK Jester is coming in a bit. In and get them. Yeah, Croc OK is coming in too late though. Ugh, oh, why is my ping so high? What ping? My ping, yeah. yeah stop downloading porn. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can always blame it on the porn, you know how they say. It was, I think it was just the pink spike. Yeah, I'm fine now. Alright, so we have Fox all by himself and three ground area that wouldn't have worked. And we see Nandy moving down into subsector. Looks like they're gonna take down the uh Resource tower in C12, finally. West Skyla is being contested. Call it just Skyla, it's now, but... Old habits die hard. Mm. Ooh, Alien's going for double. But Marine's going wow, for main dude, hive. Where did they assist from? Oh, I see, they assisted from cargo. If Marines don't contest that nano grid, aliens gonna have a very big number of resources. Mm-hmm. Crazy Commando got taken out by Nandy. Marines are holding four RTs happily. Yep, they top of is gonna go down. Yep, and they get oh let's get out of there pretty quick. Not quick enough. And they have to rebuild. We have a three marine uh, movement going right, Dave. Oh, they don't see him. Excellent hiding voice. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I missed nice the action now nice. because the game put me through the wall. Oh, and one even got in the face by the spit from Gorge. And having those Hydras messed it up is a good idea because they get extra health as they get more mature. Titaniac got both skulks in the C12. Wow, very good, very good gunplay. We got go on. We have face taken mines. Uh, looks like they went for a crag hive. Marines should definitely put no, it in upgrades. system waypointing. I don't know why they're not doing it. They could keep the pressure up. 
It looks like. Oh, Nandy by. Oh, Nandy's by himself. Taken out by crazy. Endo. Here he comes again, though. There goes one of the Hydras. Oh, but here comes another Skulk and the mines. Yeah, my ping keeps spike. Maximo gets taken out. And. Oh, mine takes out Max. We have a Satania Croc back in the dome. Oh, and Dapes is a lurk. Quick lurk. Very indeed. Yeah, he's really good as a lurk. I remember watching him before. Cargo is claimed second high for the aliens. And aliens went for region first. Now that's a very fancy hmm. upgrade to be called. Works out. You know, that, that right now, uh, the Marines are getting weapons one now, but... I mean, it's weird to see First Hive being given a crag on this map, let alone go for a... Uh, go for regen. Well, maybe Mint knows something we don't. <laughs> yep. Or Minty. Oh my god, we have double lurks. No mines on the face gate, unfortunately, and that Marine... Oh, Nandy trying his best! Oh, oh my god! Oh, drop mines immediately! And we see Sis coming through to prevent them from doing that again. But we do have two Marines and goes the Lurk down. There's two Marines moving into Pipeline. Crazy Commando sees them, gets taken out. Fox is there. Oh, there's two good bots. All right, I'm gonna go for that one. All right, there, got a ping on the hive. Oh, uh, Sataniac goes down. Dave's is coming in. Oh, he lost. He died. You know, this is what Grandery oh, is known nice from. They actually go for hive pressure while the old aliens are on the other side and they make an egg lock. Oh, uh, uh, crazy commando had 2% health. Took out. Um, Croc. Very nice. Oh, Bape Boy's alert now. We have shotguns coming up and weapons too. This is gonna hurt aliens a lot. Oh, Crag in the back of the Nano. Very good play by both teams. Oh, very nice. This works. Satanic takes out Crazy Commando. But Dapes comes in and gets him. Subsector is claimed, but not built yet. Probably just preventing the alien from putting a third hive down. Croco got a nice engagement in C12. He's gonna take the no down. Here comes Fox and clears out the Y junction. Hmm. I have a Croc taking out C12 again. And what we got here? Attacks on the phase gate. Oh, found the drifter there. Oh, Nandy sneaking around and go. Oh, the power was built. Oh, they're putting a phase. They're trying to put a phase gate up. I wonder if we're gonna see. Just as cargo is finished, phase gate's gonna go up right in cargo. That's a very good thing. While uh, Bait Boy tries. To we need the phase to gate see an point. instant beacon and teleport straight to the hive. You didn't want to have a chance with it. With some shotguns as well. Yeah, they're being they're being attacked by a... Uh, and there we go, four marines hydrogen. getting in. We, we have four marines. Four marines, crazy commandos going down. Dave is coming in. Five marines in. Oh, he goes down. Fox. Mines. Aliens coming in one by one. That's not gonna work. Not against Grahandiri. Maximo being Hive. alone there with a shotgun. That weapon too really hurts the Hive a lot and they need to focus on the Hive, not on aliens. Well, I know, I know, it's a double-edged sword. It's a double-edged sword, but they are currently That's winning. 20. 17. Oh, it's going down! There goes Cargo! 
Oh, wow. And Marines got a big win from this because it's going to delay aliens for another three minutes. And mm -hmm. they're still not giving up on that phase gate. Look at that pistoling. Oh, the mine. Oof. Nope, Marines are definitely want to lock down this hive. Yeah, they're getting us back, back though. And now it's going to be the Marines in one by one through cargo. The aliens have enough to put it down again. They just need to wait for the Marine pressured out. Oh, but there's one more alien. Spilling through. Spilling through this gate and just dying. There we go, three of them at once. No oh, good. Oh, but here oh, comes an enzyme. Eczema with nano shield. The most trying. Wow, they actually did it. Welders are up. Armor one is up. Skate's getting well. Yeah, aliens are holding nano grid, but what's the point if Marines got the hive on lockdown? Now, if they could, get, if they could keep those five rest nodes being up they could definitely get enough tech fast enough to do it i mean they're up to 26 rest nodes we can see weapons three any second now yeah but the yeah, armor two yeah. just got leaded. oh we have mandy or nandy up in uh nano grid it's, taking out the hydra it's Nandy. yeah, yeah i know <laughs> I, was, I was mistaken i apologize no, no, i'm just saying i know grandery well enough to, to know their <laughs> nicknames <laughs> Oh, but we got Fox being a fade. It's so close to Mandy. Oh, look at Satanic versus... We do have Fox as a fade. Yeah, that's the, that's the only we, uh, thing they can go back now, is wait for the pure Estona. Mm. And there isn't... That's not going to be for a while. Big engage, we got Fox coming in with Bait Boy. Oh, what a focus down. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, oh, very nice. Fox is almost... Look, look at that. Look at... Oh, my God! Oh, oh my Eximo God. gets the kill with a pistol. Holy crap. Oh. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Minty just got kicked in the balls by this move. <laughs> we got a... Uh, they took out one of the resource towers in Nano Grid before getting pushed out. We got Titaniac taken out, C12 again. Well, they are dropping Lurk Hags because they Fox phone is a Lurk now. Right. If they... What do we got here? We have... Oh, wow, they sit in the subsector and have Wits taking out power. No, oh, the grenade launchers won't help. Very nice. They could really use some flamethrowers, though. They do have advanced armory now. Poor Croc, he's by himself. Two, three whips. Not all of them are built yet. And Dave, oh, here comes Dave. Oh, Take him out. Oh, there we go. They're repushing. And there's no phase gate here in subsector. There's one system waypointing, though. Mm -hmm. And the power goes out. This command chair is going to advance right as the advanced armory is complete. Yeah, Nandy and Croc coming in. Nano grids the chair. And they go down. They're gonna save it. They should definitely put oh, some. Um, I know it's not a good idea, but they need to put some of the sentry turrets there to defend it from being assisted up again. Mm. I say that as many times if aliens get a lot of resources, they're gonna come to desperate measure tactics. And dropping a ninja hive is again one of them. Marine's not seeing it. Yeah, I think. So. I just saw. I think they might have. I saw a marine go right back through the phase gate and cargo. No, aliens are using this. Oh, there it goes. Maybe it's going down to cargo. We have Runkey taking out the guy again, nano grid. No, but the marines got it. But not and they got it in the last second through the phase gate and cargo, and they're gonna redrop it now. Oh my goodness, three of them. Titanic, Eximo, and Nandy. 16, 10, 5. Another oh fade. Goodness. 5 again. Oh, no. Oh, 2. Oh, and it goes down again. 
Marines got cleared out, but the Hive got killed again, so aliens are back at low res. Mm -hmm. And there's a Hinnies gate over here in cargo. Sister's still there in sector, though. Ooh, jetpack started. Jetpacks have started. This is exciting. This is something I haven't seen yet recently. Jetpacks. Yeah, oh, Exim getting whip bashed. And usually the game's end by then. And he goes down. See Tanya being a ninja again in C12. Oh, yeah, we have two lurks and a fade. We definitely need to see either Weapons 3 or Armor 3 coming for our Marines. But Weapon 2 is a, gotta say, nice decision. Seeing the fade on the field puts it to fade having to hit Marines uh, three times to kill him instead of two. Now look at that. Eximo. Oh, they got pressure and nanos like everywhere. Nandy. Nandy versus Fox. Oh. Cargo's claimed again. And that regeneration of the lurker kicks that looks in. Like this. <laughs> I got uh, Fox is taking out the trying to take out the power in subsector by himself. Three greens up in nano grid. I'll say Tanyang being ninja in the main hive again. Oh, but he's hitting the wrong egg. The bait boy is just in the other one. And I think Bait Boy Ooh, went Pure Sonas. There he goes. Or a fade, I'm really not sure. Did he have enough? I'm not sure he had a lot of rest. I remember seeing him oh fade. Now have two fades and three lurks on I the field. Fade, all right. Yeah, the commander's out of this too, so it's all six aliens. And the Marines go out in nano, but there's a phase gate. Oh, Sataniac with a jetpack. But well, here's a fade. Sataniac dodges. We got weapons three coming up for the aliens. This is the first match, and it's already going 17 minutes. This is yeah, awesome. and I have to say, I really like the way it's going, giggity. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much for what? your girlfriend. You're going to have to owe her. Oh my god, I, <laughs> I will not even start what the hell I, I'm going to have to do. <laughs> oh, the hive is dropped again in cargo. Yep, they're dropping in. He's in here trying to How take the hell did I miss 60% drone hive? No, I wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Tip it> yeah. <laughs> No, I have so much on my yeah. I have so much on my mind with my girlfriend. I'm missing 60% grown hives. The better to not cast with any any problem than to cast with something on your mind. Marines <laughs> kicking in with seven rest there nodes. This is gonna be painful for aliens. Jet packs everywhere. To be honest, I can't see Marines losing this one. They can just make an arc train and go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I got Titaniac and Pipeline taking out eggs. She's doing a very good job. Not just but, taking oh, out eggs, taking coming. out aliens as well. Yeah. Jetpacks. Not gonna do him any good. Now there's four, more, four aliens. Yeah, he it's goes gonna down. buy. And we have more. It's gonna buy time for cargo hive. Back in cargo. Those. 24%. Oh, right as it finishes, it goes down. Ouch. Weapons 3 are kicked in and armor 3 starts and Menti says GG. Good, good game is oh my god. That's it. They had, they had no upgrades and what the Marines are pretty much teched yeah, this out. Is, this is the problem when you go for Crag Hive instead of the Shift Hive on this map. You really do need the extra mobility the Shift provides. To be able to harass on all sides and all fronts. And hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so for co-casting and see you guys next time. Command station under attack.